Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm just gonna film a little uh, makeup collection video as fast as possible because I don't have much space in my phone, but it is my video that is the most watched on my channel, so I was like, might as well film another one. So I'm just gonna go through everything quite quickly. Um, starting off over here, um, Mario Bajescu, um, Aloe Kemu, and La La Lavender. Can't even talk. Facial spray, ColourPop All Star, um, setting spray, Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Um, I think that's all of the makeup y bits on there. These are my brushes. Um, I've got some Real Techniques, some Morphe, some ColourPop, some what's this Moda brand, um, Real Techniques Sponge. Um, I think that's it for brushes. I have a couple of wet and wild ones. And yeah. Up here I have, oh my god, quite a lot. Um, Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder. Um, like makeup. Sorry about the lighting. BYS Sports Fix Concealer. Colourpop Translucent Setting Powder. Colourpop. Um, Super Shock Highlighter and Lunch Money, Flower Beauty, Light Illusions Foundation in the shade L2, I think. Yeah, L2 Ivory. Um, Maybelline Mega Plush Rolling Express Mascara. I'm trying not to make a mess of everything. Ah. Elf um, Sun Kissed Glow Bronzer. Benefit Gimme Brow in shade 4. Wet n Wild Color Icon Blush in Mellow Wine. Royal Melon Dollar Baby Blush. Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder in shade Blossom Glow. Over here we have a Josie Moran Argan Enlightenment Illuminator. Um, that is a sample size that I got from Mecca. I have two. MAC Love Me Lipsticks, just show you the shades real quick, that one is Trey Blase, this one is called My Little Secret, it's a pink, um, also MAC Velvet Teddy, um, Maybelline Lipstick in the shade Mo For Me. Um, Urban Decay Vice Lipstick in the shade Uptight. Oop, can't get it off. That's the colour. Um, Flower Beauty Lipstick in the shade Pink Orchid. BYS Mega Shine Lip Gloss in the shade Scent Cocktail. This is my favourite lip gloss. Um, very, very good lip gloss, I think. Um, Revolution Concealer in the shade C2, um, Essence Lipstick in shade 07, this is my formal lipstick, um, I've had it for like 3 or 4 years now, um, I don't think I'll ever throw it away, um, a couple of Wet n Wild lipsticks, one is Mocalicious, the other one is Never Nude. Back here is a an e.l.f. Um, Lock-on liner and brow cream that I use as a brow pomade. Um, Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. Urban Decay Naked Palette. Whoopsie, I'm just making a mess of everything. Um, Colourpop Lippy Liner in shade Faded. Colourpop gloss in the shade snow day call pop will be sticks in the shade little things that's something that i just picked up call pop will amazing scar in the shade brownie points that's the brown one um color pop cream gel liner in the shade dtla um, a BYS Coal Eyeliner Pencil in the shade Soft White. Sorry about these angles. I'm just trying to go through them all quickly. Um, 
Benefit Precisely My Brow in the shade 3.5. Um, Steel Sail Day Eyeliner in black. I have a couple of Wet n Wild Color Icon pencils. One's an eyeliner called, I think it's called Calling Your Bluff, Buff or something. Yeah, Calling Your Buff. And then two lip liners. One is in, oh my god, this is so hard. Chestnut, one is in. Willow. They're both nudes. They're not as dark as the pencil is. Um, a Rimmel lip liner in the shade Black Tulip. A Wet n Wild retractable brow pencil in the shade Ash Brown. I already said that one. Um, this is a NYX eye and eyebrow pencil in the shade Dark Brown. Oh, oh my god, I keep picking up the same thing. Um, Colourpop Liquid Liner in the shade Grande, it's a brown one. Um, Rimmel Glam Eyes Liquid Eyeliner. I think that is everything that was in there, I hope. <laughs> um, back here, I've got the Morphe uh, 39S palette. This is not going well. In here I have a couple of foundation samples, this one is a CRT one, I can't remember which one it is, and this is the Too Faced Do You, and then I have a couple of Colourpop um, concealers, one is in light 10 and one is light 12, and then I have a replacement of light 10, oh, this one's not opening, this is like my shiny glitter stuff, I got the NYX glitter glue, um, a Colourpop Super Shock Shadow in the shade Frog. Sorry about my hairy airbrush there, don't look at that. Um, Barry M Fine Glitter Dust in the shade 15. These are beautiful. I have a couple of craft glitters for various looks in there. Um, a BYS Body Glitter. It's like a blue... You can't really tell. It's a blue shade. Um, another Colourpop Super Shock Shadow in the shade 3 is a cloud. Um, a NYX pigment in the shade, I think it's the shade Luna. Yep. Um, and another Barry M. This one is a body glitter. Um, I think it's the shade Ultraviolet. Oh my god, how pretty. Um, and I also have a an e.l.f. Really sparkly eyeliner in the shade Pink Opal. And that's everything in that little drawer. Next drawer down, I have a Colourpop lipstick, I can't remember what they're called, it's like a ready colour, um, e.l.f. highlighter, moonlight pearls, I have a Revlon red lipstick in the shade 004, retro red, um, Astralis Colour Clip Primer in the shade Miss Ivy, I have a little sharpener, I have Colourpop All Star Primer. Um, I have a little sample size of the Benefit Cabrow in shade 3.5. Um, NYX Glitter in shade Bronze. Dubai Bronze, I think it says. I have a couple of the BYS Pure Silk Drops. This is the shade Sunlight. This is the shade Amethyst. And a Maybelline 24 hour colour tattoo metal um, in this champagne colour, barely branded. That's everything in there. Next drawer down. This is mostly um, lip products in here. Um, I have a concealer, the Beauty Light Illusions full coverage concealer in the shade. L1 to 2 Fair. Um, I have a Colourpop Lippy Stick in the shade LBB. NYX White Eyeliner. NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Black Bean, I think. Yeah, Black Bean. I have a couple of Colourpop Lip Liners um, in the shade Rouge. Um, I can't even read Bossy, I think that one is. And this one is Viper. Um, I have another. BYS Neon Eyeliner Pencil, well not another one, I only have one, um, that's in Neon Blue, I have a mini 
Mecca Max Pout Pop lipstick that I can't open to show you the colour. Very orange. Um, I have a couple of these Be Beauty lip glosses. They're from Big W. I have this Rimmel lipstick. Um, I have another couple of Revlon lipsticks. This one is my all time favourite in the shade. Um, 745 Love is On, and this one is shade 02 Pink Pout. Um, I forgot to say what this shade that the river one is, it's shade 101. Um, I have a NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Tiramisu. I have a NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Sydney. I also have a NYX Lid Lingerie um, in the shade... I, don't, I can't read it. You can't even see it. I don't know. L I D L I O two. I don't know. Um, this is the rest of my makeup. I'm just gonna go through really quickly for our Beauty Light Illusion Perfecting Powder, which I kind of love. I'm a fan. One of these stupid sponges. Um, a ColourPop pigment in quicksand. This is when they first brought them out. Um, some lipstick samples. Maybelline the Fall Seas Volume Express Mascara, that's brand new. Um, it's a replacement for when my other one dries out. Colourpop Supernova Shadow in the shade Moonlit. Another NYX pigment in the shade Insomnia. Mm, Colourpop Super Shock Shadow in the shade Erase You. Colourpop Super Shock Shadow in the shade Set to Stun, oh my goodness. Speaking it so hard. Um, another super shock shadow in the shade Polly. Some little rhinestones. A One Direction lip gloss that I've had for about five years and I still wear it because it is bum. It's called Over Again. Um, a replacement super shock cheek highlighter in the shade Lunch Money for when my other one runs out. A replacement Australia's Color Quick Primer for when my other one runs out. Mario Badescu Facial Spray Aloe Cucumber Green Tea. This is just a little compact mirror. I, don't know what to that. I have a couple more Barry M glitters. One is like a blue, one's like a pink. Um, I can't read the stickers on them because it's so rubbed off. So I'm sorry about that. Um, more glitter. I'm pretty sure these are BYS. Um, but oh my god, I wasn't even holding it in the frame. Anyway. Yeah, so silver spilled out in there, as you can probably see, and so I only have the red and black in there now. Um, a mini MAC Fix Plus in the cucumber scent. Um, full size Fix Plus in, in oh my god, I can't even talk anymore, this is the lavender scent. Um, another Super Note Shadow, this is a shade Firecracker. Um, a Colourpop Blush Sticks in the shade. Mic drop, which I wish it was the same shade as the two, but it's not. It's very oh, I can't get the lid off. Very orangey, bright pink. Whoops, struggling today, guys. Um, and next, just a tint lip crayon in the shade. Where's the shade? Maui Wowie. Um, Wet and Wild Cat Liquid Cat Suit. Lipstick in the shade Nudist Peach. Um, I hate this lipstick more than I hate other liquid lipsticks. It was just so stupid and gross. Um, Colourpop Brow Boss Gel. It, that's the clear one. Um, a Duochrome lip gloss from NYX, which I hate because it shows up straight yellow. Um, I have a couple of B Beauty lip liners. Or Bay Bow Beauty, I can't read it. I don't know, they're just both like pink. Oh, I got an itchy nose. Um, a Revlon lip gloss in the shade 585. Oh my god, the writing on those things is so small. I hate trying to read them. Um, these are all Colourpop, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's actually a fake one from like eBay or something. It says Alyssa on the bottom. This is one of the Hello Kitty ones. This is Ribbon. I 
have one in K. Put everything sticking together. Barracuda. This one is Times Square. Um, this one is Platform Shoes. No, Platform. Just Platform. Don't even listen to me. And then this last one is Viper. Um, those are a mix of the Ultra Matte and the Ultra Satin finish. Um, foundations, Too Faced Born This Way in the shape Vanilla, which is too dark for me, which I normally mix it with the Rimmel Match Perfection in the shade O10 Porcelain, which is too light. So I mix those two together. Um, I have this W7 Honolulu Liquid Bronzer, which I haven't really tried properly yet. W7 Pump and Blush in the shade... Um, peachy. I haven't tried that one yet either. Um, Colourpop No Filter Foundation in the shade Fair 25. Um, Matte and Poreless Maybelline Foundation in the shade 110. Um, Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the shade Porcelain. Um, these are just a couple of samples. Dior Backstage and more Too Faced which is too dark. Fenty Beauty in the shade 120. Um, I have this powder which I hate. It's like a an HD powder. It's awful. Um, Maybelline Fit Me powder in the shade 10. Um, I have this Mother's Preferred palette which I love and it's damaged and I can't open it. There you go. Dropped it so I had to repress it. But that is a brilliant product. It was like. $10 maybe. Highly recommend this. I do not recommend. It's awful. Revolution Strobe Highlighter. Um, not good. This is just eyelashes in here. More eBay eyelashes. Um, whoops. Can I get it all out? Um, Smashbox Drawn In Doubt Face Sculpting Palette, which I've had forever. I love it. Um, a Colourpop Magnetic Palette. These are all Colourpop products. This is a bronzer in the shade. Um, I can't read it. Afternoon Delight. This is a pressed highlighter in the shade Here Kitty Kitty. And this is a pressed powder in the shade. I think it's light. Sorry. Um, this is Best Coast Scenario. This is Snake Eyes. This is Going Steady. This is... Cute and this is Lucky Guy, and I bought these four in the quad, but they never sent me the little quad palette thing, so that's why they're in there. Um, Too Faced Gingerbread Spice palette. This is a pretty recent purchase, and I freaking love it. Colourpop Fame palette. Um, I bought this because it was on clearance because I think they're discontinuing it, but I don't really have any colours like this in my collection, so I bought it. Pretty sure I bought that before I bought the Naked palette. Um, BYS Cream Glitter Eye Cream, which I don't recommend. It's not very good. I'd probably recommend it if maybe you're going to a festival and you just want some body glitter. That's the only time I would recommend that. Um, Colourpop Take It Home. I love this palette too. Such an easy on the go palette. Um, this is, I don't know where this is from, but I've absolutely loved it to death. I stole it off my sister. The Revolution Palettes. This one is Reloaded Velvet Rose. And this one is Reloaded Iconic Division. Um, I've got the mirror, which I didn't mean to break. Whoopsie. Um, here I have the Models Prefer Shadows palette. It's all matte nudes. Oh my god, that's not a very good angle. There we go. That's a bit better. Um, MK Naked 3, which is my first ever proper eyeshadow palette. Oh, I still love her. She is beautiful. Um, BYS Bloom palette. Highly recommend all BYS palettes because they're all fabulous. Um, Rebel. Whoopsie. I love this one too. She looks looking very green actually. She's more warm than she looks. 
um, color for Violet Pony. Um, these little cardboard palettes, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if they still are, they're magnetic so you can pop the pans out and rearrange them if you want, which is what I did here. Um, color for Clockwork, Cheek Duo, I feel like I'm being very like, clunky and loud, but whoopsie, she's real pretty, I want to get to use her more. Um, BYS Festival eyeshadow palette, iconic, one of the best affordable palettes out there, or colourful palettes anyway, she's great. Um, last but not least is the BYS Peach palette, which is not my favourite, it only has three mattes, but it's still beautiful, all of the like, shimmery, pearly, metallic shades work wonderfully, um, I'd still recommend her. Um, and I'm not going to pull this one out because it's a bitch and I, mm, she's not my favourite, she doesn't perform very well, but uh, this is the BH Cosmetic 6 Edition 120 Colour Eyeshadow Palette. I'm just going to open it up actually. She looks like this. She's got two levels. Um, yeah, she's not great. And yeah, she's very inexpensive, but I get almost no use out of it because... They just don't perform well, but I don't want to throw it out in case I need it for just like some book. So, anyway. That is it for my Makeup Collection 2020 edition. Sorry it is so rushed and such bad angles. Um, filming on my phone kind of sucks, but it's all I've got for the minute, so I've got to make do. Um... Yeah, if you have any questions about specific products, you can comment below and I'll let you know how I feel about it. I was trying to just get through everything quickly just to show you what I have because my phone's almost out of storage and I don't I didn't want it to cut off filming again. So yeah. If you have any questions, leave them below. Any queries about products, leave them below and I'll answer them. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you're staying safe and inside. Wash your hands. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.